Hi, I'm Dr. Stanley Lam. Uh, today I'm going to do a prolotherapy for uh, this lady's neck. Okay, let's start. Okay, could you bend down a little bit? Yes. The first thing I'm going to do is to um, uh, apply some local anesthetics over the skin, over the, the region I'm going to inject. Are you okay? Yep. Is it very painful? It's just a... Uh, mm, just a little. Just a little bit. Okay. And... Um, and the marking I'm... Uh, I draw is... Um, corresponding to the interspinal space. That is the space between the two spinous processes of the cervical spine. And um, these are the, the facet joints. Okay. After applying local anesthetics, and then, and then we start uh, using these. Uh, we bend down a little bit. Yes, good. Okay. Um, for applying local anesthetics, I'm using uh, just a 30 gauge, uh, one inch needle. It is very very small, even smaller than what you get you get um, when take when um, having a vaccination when for example your flu shot. Are you okay? Yeah. Okay. This is the spine C two spinous process. That is very important because all the suboccipital muscles uh, are attached here and. Uh, if this part is um, having problem because some, uh, for example, the tendon injuries, ligament laxity, uh, tendon laxity, and then people a lot of time are presented with uh, uh, chronic neck and head pain, and um, we also have giddiness or dizziness of a tiger is due to the neck because of the loosening of this uh, cervical spine and uh, it's very easy for the C2 to get out of alignment and uh, on top of the C3 and um, that creates um, a strong force sensation to, to your brain that uh, oh the head is uh, always uh, out of alignment and it's all, always not in the correct position and um, you can see this um, prolotherapy can be done very quick and uh, it's uh, it's also well tolerated. Are you okay? Yeah. Okay. It's just a little sore. Just a little sore, right? Okay, I finished the spinous process and uh, this is the facet joint. Are you okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Now we need to change to a longer needle because the facet joint is uh, is uh, usually quite deep. This is a twenty-five gauge two-inch needle. Yes. Right now I can touch the, the facet more easily. And then the technique is uh, always hit bone and inject. Okay, that is the facet. Are you okay? Yep. So this is this treatment is very good for those patients with uh, uh, whiplash injury. Uh, 
with um, chronic poor posture because the poor posture, for example, using the computer for a long time uh, with the head protruding forward and it's very easy to create problems in the uh, stretch to put a lot of stress over the uh, post, I mean the, the, the back and the, the neck especially the posterior, I mean the back of the neck um, with those ligaments uh, become very loose in the medical term is lax and uh, with this laxity the patient is um, easily get um, the cervical spine out of alignment Are you okay? A little Okay and then that's the injection, the, the prototherapy to the cervical spine. Okay.